everyone. Thank you for joining our beautiful program that um, Kim and Jeremy's put together for us today. Um, welcome to everyone. Uh, we're in for a fantastic, it's been awesome today and I really want to thank and congratulate everyone that's taken the time out of their day to, to um, take part in this. It's been really fantastic. So what I'm going to tune in and talk to you about this afternoon is something that I think is really, really important, particularly at the um, environment that we're in right now. But, um, you know, this, this time is, I guess, send us all for a, a spin. Um, and, you know, even though it's some of us, are, some people are still going to work as a, essential services and so forth. For, for the ones that are at home and um, like me and many of uh, many others of us, it's time to really start to do the work on ourselves. And uh, in a busy time when we're mums, working, having children at school, sporting events and so forth, you know, as mums where we, we run in this crazy world and to be able to be actually shut down in this time is, um, is, is um, you know, it's a time for us to really do the work on ourselves more than and ever before. We've all got time to start to do that work on ourselves. So I wanted to take you through just a couple of really great protocols that um, that I use myself. Um, this was one of the reasons that I came into Young Living very much in the first place four years ago. So back four years ago, I had a, a massive crash of my hormones and with having a crash of that hormone sent my emotions running for, for a, you know, just spiraled out of control, not realising that the products that I was using was actually causing and interrupting and disrupting my hormones and um, causing all sorts of problems to go through, around in my body, but also it was the state of the life of my life that I was in as well. So today I want to take you through my very, very first kit that I ever got with Young Living and that is our emotional um, detox, or I call it our emotional detox in a box, which is our feelings kit. So this is my very favourite kit that we have in Young Living. Um, it's a beautiful kit um, that has six gorgeous oils in it that really help you to, to understand where you are feeling emotionally. Now, I know more than ever before, so many people are paralysed in fear, total fear. And, you know, when we, we're stuck in fear, and I know it is a really fearful time in the world for all of us and with our families and children and, and so forth. But, you know, when we're stuck in fear, our, our brain releases uh, a toxic chemical called cortisol into our bloodstream, which actually lowers our immune, suppresses our immune system. And, you know, at this time, that's the last thing we want. We really want to be able to, to support our immune system in this time. And many people have talked about some of our incredible products that we have, our Ninja and Sulfazyme and, and lots of other products that we have, beautiful oils, thieves, so many beautiful oils that we have to support our immune system in, in this crazy world that we're in right now. But I wanted to, to talk to you about, you know, it's not just supporting yourself on a... Um, a physical level but let's support ourselves on an emotional level now if we're in this for six months and we're you know going to be in you know kind of in our homes for six months i know this is a time that really stirs up so many emotions it has for me already last week i had a day that was like wow you know where did that come from and i felt really um unbalanced and and really not grounded at all so I really want to share with you some of the things that I've um, that, that I'm an absolute firm believer in. I know that they work 100%, and I'm so grateful. In fact, I share shout myself this kit every quarter because you know, for me, if I can keep myself grounded on a level keel, it helps me not only in my life but also in my business, and I think it's really important after working with women for nearly 20 years, you know, what stops people from actually moving through those emotional states and being the best that they can be? It's usually things stuck around emotions. It's what's going on up in here. You know, this is what stops us all because, you know, we're not lazy and we've all got 
so many beautiful skills that we can you know that we can use to to help each other as women we have a heart that we want to help others and we're also very good at you know if we find something great we're also very good at sharing with others that thing you know whether it's a pair of shoes whether it's a great restaurant whether it's a great hairdresser whatever it is so I know that we, as women, we naturally good at all those things, but what actually stops us from moving forward in our lives and, and particularly in our business? So, you know, why, why have we got, you know, why are there some of us that have got, you know, we've all got great products, we've all got great marketing, we're supported by great company, we certainly have a great oily community or oily family. Uh, which I'm more than grateful for at this time, but what stops us? What allows some of us to move through and what moves, what stops others from moving through to, to wherever they are, whether it's diamond, platinum, gold, wherever it is that you're, you're choosing, whether it's only just to, to make an extra $500 a month for your family, that's going to make a difference for a lot of people as well. So what I've discovered in, in all my time with, with mentoring and working with people, it's what's going on here. And it's usually this, as I talk about this, two emotions. You can come from a place of love or you can come from a place of fear. And at this time, most people are sitting over in the fear corner. So what I want you to do is to try and help you become grounded and really gain courage to step through that fear barrier or that terror barrier. What is it that holds you back? Because, you know, I am ever so grateful in this particular time right now in my life that we have a, a beautiful business that I can help so many people, um, whether it's online, obviously I'm not doing face-to-face -face because we're in isolation, but I can certainly do um, appointments with Skype and so many other things. So I want to share with you some of the things that I do right now to support myself but also to support others um, when they come through and, and need a little bit of help because you know we're all in this together and if i can share some of that 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 love based rather than coming from fear based you know because we don't want to put more fear into people people are already fearful so let's come from a place of love that we can help and support one another. So what's one of the first things that I do? So one of the first things that I do is, is with our, from our feelings kit and it's got six beautiful oils. So I wanna take you through those oils and show you how to use those. So the first step of the protocol is, is Valor. And this is in our feelings kit. So once you've purchased yourself a feelings kit and it's something that you want to be able to do the work on yourself right now, um, you'll be you'll have access to to all of these notes that I'm sharing that right now. So don't worry if you haven't got time to, to write them. I'd rather you listen in and to, and listen to what I how I can share some of the things that I've learned throughout my time. So Valor is a if Valor is for courage. And if there's any oil that I could recommend right now to use every single day, it's Valor. Valor's for courage. So this is safe to use on um, children as well. But I'm going to, so, you know, I use three drops myself on each hand. So every morning, what I feel is really important for me right now is to get grounded and, and have courage to be able to support each other and hold the space for each other because, you know, we're all going to be going through an emotional little merry-go-round as time goes on. So Valor, so three drops on your right hand and I put it on the bottom of my left foot. Now, I'm not that flexible. They're going to pull my foot right up and show you, but if I did, I can do it sitting here now. It's great to either sit cross-legged on your bed or if you've got a yoga bolster, sit on a yoga bolster. Or if it's not possible for you to cross your to cross your legs if you've got knee problems, just do one foot at a time. But just hold, cup your hand underneath your left foot and hold it there. And then three drops on my left hand onto my right foot and then I hold that there. Now that's called a valor balance. We actually use it in lots of techniques um, in Young Living. 
We use it in our raindrop technique. I use it in my Egyptian emotional healing technique. I use it in so many techniques. And it's one of those things, if you can do one thing right now, do your valor balance, get yourself grounded, get yourself some courage with the 3000 energy channels that are running through your body. And we're all over the shop. If you're, you know, we're feeling scattered, we're feeling fear, we're feeling not knowing what's going on, what's, you know, what's in front of us. We've all had so many things, losing jobs and so forth. So if you can just close your eyes and sit with yourself five minutes, 10 minutes, whatever it is that you want to do until you can feel yourself calming down and getting yourself grounded with courage. Okay, the next step that we're going to take on is we're going to take on our beautiful blend, which is called Harmony. Now, with Harmony, it's really important that we, we um, you know, that we keep ourselves uh, really grounded with with harmony and we have all our different energy centers or our chakras that are run through our body and um, I think it's really important that we we learn how to really go through so again three drops on your right hand circulate three times to activate the energy three big inhalations right down into your tummy so you know when we're in place of fear we kind of do more shallow breathing so just by doing three simple breaths down into your tummy right down into your tummy just simply by doing that you're starting to slow your breathing down you're starting to come from that heightened emotion of state and you're starting to come become more grounded so if at any time you feel yourself going into a heightened emotional state I want you to think of a couple of things. Stop. What can I do right now? Because that's the only thing we've got control of is what can I do right now? So ask yourself some what questions. Not why is this happening? What am I going to do? Just what can I do right now to get myself into a place of feeling calm that I don't feel in a heightened emotional state so three drops of harmony is an absolutely beautiful blend three big deep breaths down into your tummy take those in you can sit and do this at home with me if you like and then really feel that sense of calmness coming through every 50 trillion cells in your body, they're all taking it in. The oil's crossing the amygdala in the brain where, the, where your, your emotions are stored. And then start to go through your chakras, your, you know, your, your crown chakra, all down through your, your chakras, your third eye, right down through your throat chakra, heart chakra, solar plexus, right down through. Now these in your notes, you're going to get all of these where all your um, all your um, chakras are, your sacred chakra and down into your root chakra. So you'll get lots of great information as you um, when you come into Young Living or if you're already a member of Young Living and you want to invest in yourself with a, with a feelings kit, all these documents are there gives the frequency so if you're sitting in a low frequency the idea now more than ever is to be in tune with our beautiful oils and really lift yourself up to a higher frequency because you don't want to sit in a lower frequency okay the next step is something that's one of the most beautiful oils that we have in our in our in our feelings kit or emotional detox kit is forgiveness you know Every single one of us has been through times in our life where we have had things go on, people have, you know, things have happened and we really haven't been happy with what's happened in those times. We may have got to a stage where we're really hurt and disappointed by what somebody's 
said or done or hasn't supported us over that time so forgiveness is one of those crucial things in your life that you can learn to forgive it doesn't mean you agree with whatever's happened to you but you need to be able to forgive that other person so that you can move forward in your life and it's not about forgiving the other person. It's about forgiving yourself or forgiving the other person so that you can move forward in your life. Otherwise, you're going to stay stuck. And I want to share this with you because, you know, before I came into Young Living, you know, there was a situation that happened in my life and I went over that same story for three years because you know, to me, it was it was about the justice and what's going. Why, why, why would somebody do that to me? You know, and we can keep asking those why questions, and you can keep yourself stuck. So it wasn't till a time that I could really forgive that person and be able to move forward in my life because she'd already moved in her life. She'd already did. She didn't give a two flying ra two flying razoos about me, she'd already moved in a life. So it was me that was the one that was stuck. So if we can inhale three beautiful drops of forgiveness, and I want you to take those beautiful three deep breaths, and I want you to say as you're taking those breaths, I forgive that person who may have hurt me, or and I forgive myself for being stuck in that emotion for such a long time because at the end of the day, you're just wasting your time. You know, re remember you get a syringe of energy to use every single day. This is how I imagine it. I get a syringe of energy every single day and I actually get to choose how I use it. And what I was doing was using my energy source or my syringe on something that wasn't serving me. So as soon as you can learn to let it go, let that go and start to, you will move forward in your life. So if that's one of the things that's holding you back from moving in your life, I want you to move through that forgiveness. And that goes in a clockwise way after you've done your inhalations around your navel. And we, why we do it around our navel is we have so many different nerve endings there, you know, so many different nerve endings that are sitting there. And forgive that other person and forgive yourself for your own peace to move forward. So that's a very crucial part of this beautiful, beautiful kit that, that, um, that I love and use so dearly every quarter for myself. That's my gift to myself to be able to use this. The next oil in this protocol is a beautiful blend called Release. Now, these are all exclusive blends by Young Living. So Young Living are the only oils that I recommend for myself and my friends and family to use. And because I really love our seed to seal process and I love the quality of our, I love that we have our own farms and I've been able to go to those farms. I see what happens in this company. I trust these oils. I trust them for myself and I trust them for my family. So release is another big thing to use. So release is letting those things go. Okay. Once we're forgiven, it's then time to release those emotions that we're hanging on to so obviously now we're releasing that fear and it might have been something that somebody has said to you in the last couple of weeks that's really got you into a heightened emotional state it may have got you into anger so you might be feeling really angry right now you might be feeling really sad right now you might be really feeling frightened right now whatever those emotions are because emotions are great We've just got to recognize them. And once we're, we recognize those emotions, we can let them go. So, you know, this, this kit is one of the most powerful um, tools that you can put in your emotional toolbox. And, you know, we need to have a, a variety of things, but I, I, this is the most powerful tool that you can use. So same thing, three big, big deep breaths right down to your tummy. Really take it in and really release those emotions that no longer are serving you. 
if they're not adding to your life and making you bringing you love and joy and happiness get rid of them why would you carry those emotions around they're heavy it's like carrying a, a load of bricks on your shoulder so release is a beautiful oil and it's something that i use every single day not just when i use my feelings kit my emotional detox box i actually use this every single day because and i put it on my liver which is just on your right side just up near your rib cage so just release and say what you're releasing i release all anger or fear that has that has built up in within me today that no longer serves me i choose to take on joy and happiness and love so replace that fear and anger and hatred and guilt and all of those other emotions that are no longer serving you release them they are heavy they are not serving you and replace them with something that does serve you i love release so moving on to our our next oil our next oil is present time and more so than ever the only thing we have right now is present time we don't have what happened yesterday or what happened last week or last year or last month that if we're going backwards that's causes what things that causes us to feel sadness and depressed you know because every single one of us has had shit going on in our life at some stage so this is and then if we look too far forward you know things are changing hourly daily and you know we none of us have any control what's going on right now but the only thing you do have control is present time so really enjoy using present time this is an oil i would use every single day right now because it's really important to me to keep myself grounded and in present time to know that i that i am safe that we are loved that everything is going to be okay we're in this together and what a beautiful community we have with each other to be in this together and then back to back in the next oil is inner child so if you're feeling like you've got the whole world on your shoulders at the moment and i know there's so much uncertainty i know within my own people have lost businesses people have there's so much going on so try and bring a little bit of inner child inner child will bring you back to your inner child you know that that time in your life where you were carefree you had no worries about bills or anything else you were just this beautiful little girl or this beautiful little boy and you had no fear I want you to bring yourself back to that place so inner child is another one that you can same thing three drops three inhalations right down into your tummy and think of a time when you were a little girl or a little boy when you were so happy it might have been a smell of a grandma baking something it might have whatever it was dancing dancing around on holidays swimming whatever you can remember back to one time in your life that you were so happy and so carefree i want you to bring yourself back to that space so that you can have that inner child back and i love this oil full of beautiful oranges and citrus fruits that have just bring that beautiful light energy back to you that's really uplifting and again around your navel and a little just hold it on your finger underneath your nose and breathe it in and close your eyes if it helps you to bring back pictures of when you were in that little girl and then again we go back to valor to finish off this beautiful process that i just adore is valor to bring back those energies let's lock in those beautiful energies of feeling safe and secure and loved and knowing that we're all here together we're all here to support each other you are not alone there's so we're all here reach out to one of us i never ever been in such a beautiful community of people in young living that we always feel like that someone's around us so 
you know, that's our feelings kit. And um, I'm going to share some graphics that my um, gorgeous friend, Danae Cazol, has done up for us all um, that you'll be able to start. If you haven't or if you're already a member, you may choose to invest in that kit. If you're not a member and you would love to start this journey with Young Living, please reach out to the person that invited you or how you found out about this beautiful um, weekend or this beautiful day that we're putting on to share each other's hearts and souls and support each other. Just one thing that somebody says might right now might just give you a little bit of hope because that's what we need right now. So some of the other kits I'm just going to share with you because I've got is our so if you if it's not our feelings kit that you want to go the full thing uh, the full hog as i call it as i said i do it every day for 30 days and it really makes a huge change and to me that would be the best investment you could do for yourself right now and your family and sit around with the kids or sit in a circle or, or whatever but get yourself that you can start to work through these emotions they're going to come up and they're going to come up pretty thick and fast and pretty damn heavy some of them because it's going to reconnect this fear is going to reconnect with every single time in your life that you felt fear there's a neurological pathway that in your brain and it's already created that pathway that says fear and adding more fear into it is going to make it pretty strong so last week i was really feeling some really heavy emotions of sadness really really strongly but it connected with other times in my life that i'd felt sadness so it's okay. The first thing is to acknowledge and then know that we've got something to release these emotions. So in our um, in our courage bundle, uh, I just want to share with you what we've got in there is the valor, which I went through first. And then we've got um, the release oil, uh, which we've been through talking about on your liver, releasing those, those things that are coming up. Acknowledge them, write them down. It's really important that you acknowledge and then let go and then the last part of that is our, another beautiful blend of oil that is called white angelica and that's something that i use every single day because you're going to be around some people whether you're going out to get groceries or whatever and you don't want to take on everyone else's energy trust me i'm having enough trouble keeping ourselves grounded at this time so again i just use three big breaths of white angelica every single day and, and then just imagine you create a beautiful white bubble around yourself. And I want you to encase yourself in a beautiful white bubble. Imagine that you've got mirrors on the outside and you're just deflecting everybody else's energy back to them. Not that, you know, they're all good people, but you don't need to take on other people's energy right now. You need to really protect your energy more so than ever. And that's white angelica. That's the blend that I use. I've used it every day as a perfume i love the smell of it people stop me all the time and ask me what perfume i've got it's white angelica it's i never use perfumes obviously they're full of chemicals now if that's for you that's a good that's a good entry point if you you only want to start with three oils they're the three oils that i'd recommend right now if you want to expand that just a little bit we would go for um this is our great day protocol. So I would go for oils like Valor again. Again, Valor is a must, must, must to help get you through this. Followed by joy, joy on your heart to, to give you joy in this time. You know, it's, it's, you know, none of us really know what's going on. So let's give ourselves some joy. Again, it's a beautiful blend of oils that I that you can pop on your heart to give you joy. And then the next oil that are in the date the great day protocol I would use is awaken. Awaken your senses and know what's going on so that you you know what's going, but you have control. You actually have control how you're going to respond in these times. You really do. You know, you can, you know that you can pick up even if it's just one oil that you can pick up to to take a deep breath and really bring awaken yourself and know go back to gratitude always. I am grateful for. So if things start to spiral a little bit out of control in your mind right now. I want you to create a new neurological pathway 
which is neuroplasticity. And I want you to create a pathway that says, I am grateful for. So if you can feel yourself going into fear, stop and go into, I am grateful for. So you might need the awaken to start to awaken that neurological pathway within your brain and go into a place of gratitude because there's always gratitude around us. Every single one of us have gratitude. Go out in the garden. You know, if you're going out on a, on a walk, oh, for me, it's just going down to the, if I'm lucky I live near a lake, I can go down to the lake. And I'm so grateful every day that I've got that opportunity to go to the lake and spend some time out with nature. Shoes off, get yourself grounded and really, you know, taking that time. And again, the fourth oil in that little pack that we've created is white angelica and that's to protect yourself and smell amazing in the meantime so i hope you've got some tips out of this remember as um kimmy brooke said <laughs> that kookaburra will be trying to put messages in your head that do not serve you so we've got to shut the kookaburra down Shut those voices in our head that keep putting fear within us. Bring us back to feeling gratitude and love. Remember, fear or love, which one do you want to go to? I certainly try to keep going to love. If I can see myself going to fear, I bring myself back to love. So sending all my love to you all. I am so incredibly grateful for each and every one of you. Uh, I'm grateful for this program that Kim and Jeremy's put up for us and I know I've thoroughly enjoyed it. If you don't get to watch them all now, go back and watch them. There's so many great things in there for you to watch. So bye for now.